Hey everybody, so the mission we've got up today is going to see Uncle. Uh, Uncle's Bad Day, I think it's called. So this might be the one I'm, uh, I was thinking of earlier. Because I thought, yeah, I know he gets captured at some point by the Skinners. I just can't, I just couldn't remember where, like when. I think this might be it. Either that or he has another bad thing happen to him that I don't remember. How was your holiday? I was making money. And to think, you call me lazy. You've done a great job. Well, that crew did help. A little house, a barn. Look at this place. <laughs> I can't believe it. Thank you. Thank you both. This calls for a drink. Young Miss at Dancing School has taught the minuet to tread. Young Miss at Dancing School has taught the minuet to tread. But we go better when we've brought our four tack to cat head. Come bustle, bustle, drink about and let us merry be. Our can is full, we'll pump it out and then all hands to see. When horn and hounds the forest rend, his pack the huntsman cheers. When horn and hounds the forest Friend his pack, the huntsman cheers. As loud as halloo when we send a broadside to Mount Sears. As loud as halloo when we send a broadside to Mount Sears. Come bustle, bustle, drink about and let us merry be. Our can is full, we'll pump it out and then our hands to see. What's got at sea we spend on shore on sweethearts and our wives. What's got at sea we spend on shore at sweethearts and our wives. And then my boys hoist sail for more, thus passes sailors' lives. And then my boys hoist sail for more, thus passes sailors' lives. Come bustle, bustle, drink about it, and let us merry be. Our can is full, let's break it out, and then our hands to see. Yeah! <laughs> John! Get out here! Uncle's gone! He's fine. Let me sleep. Get out here now! <sighs> that fat man will be fine. No, he won't. Skinners. You think? Of course. My guess is they went that way. But my other guess is they know we're coming after him. What choice do we have? None. We just gotta keep our wits about us. We know this is a trap. <clears throat> Let's ride. Yeah. I have to say that every a part of this walkthrough, Let's I think. Go. Let's ride. Yeah. I tracked them to the road. We'll pick up the trail there. Shit. It's like we forgot about them. We should have been ready. It happened. There's nothing we can do except try and get him back. We let our guards down for one moment. Hush. Up here. You see that? Blood. Dear Lord. They've gone up towards tall trees. Come on. John, look. We should agree on something. If it's really bad, this might not be about saving him. What the hell are you talking about? If it's really bad, it might be better to stop the pain. Jesus, you mean to... I mean, you can live a week without a scalp, but it ain't a good week. A gut wound, you can live a month, but it's horrible. What they've done to him might have killed him already, with only hurt to come. We get him, and we see, okay? We'll make it his call if we can. But it may be we have to decide. Okay? Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to use the bow. Um, uh, 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 where is it? There you go. Did you hear something? Yeah. You think they saw us coming? I don't know. I guess we'll soon find out. We'll be better off going on on foot. Okay. Leave the whole... This is in the trees there. 
Yeah, I think I'm gonna. This is gonna be the rare occasion where I take two rifles with me. No. Rifles, I said. Where's the shotgun? There you go. Stay. To the trees. Come on. Up there, to the right. Two Skinners. Lookouts? Probably. Take one. Oh, that's why I needed the bow, of course. Take the other. They're down. Move. That's an impressive distance to throw a knife. Keep your head. We'll find him. Come on. Hold. Patrol to our left. Shh. Let him go. Come from the ranch, they'll come this way. We should have burned it while they slept. The burning's better if they're awake for it. He's old and sick, he won't last long. Then when they come, they'll come for a corpse. He was talking about Uncle. He's alive. Mm. Come on, they've passed. Let's go. Where are we going? Hold up. You hear that? Yeah. Wagon. There. It's dragging someone. Is it uncle? No. Some other poor bastard. Let's follow. It might lead us to the camp. Keep on him. Well, that's just not nice. Yeah, that'll be the, the, the guy driving the wagon to be the first guy who gets a tomahawk through He's his stopping. head. Oh shit! What do you see? He's picking up. Poor bastard's dead. If he's walking with the body, we must be close. Let's take him down before he gets to the rest. Yeah, gonna flan tomahawk his ass. If that guy wasn't dead, he had a tomahawk in his back for nothing. I think I see something. Uh huh. Oh, well, he's dead now. Yeah, he's probably uh, the the yeah, crazy. Yeah, must be their camp. What do we do? Let's get up on that boulder. I mean, look at that look. beard. He must have been here a while. In there, old man. Probably one of them. Probably. Okay, okay. I can't see much through this mist. Can you look too? Hold on. Why do I need my binoculars? I've got eyes. God. We 
gotta go get him. Careful. Where are they? Where are they? I don't care. Come on! Uh, Charles! Uh, 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 behind you! Do this. All of you. I'll go. They're coming in from everywhere. Behind the rocks. There. Almost got them. Let go. Get it back, fella. For me, John. Hell, rip his head off. Uncle. Uncle. What have they done to you? Oh, we gotta get you down. You're okay, old man. I look okay. You look awful. You'll be okay. Those bastards. We got them. Oh. Oh, looks like we got here just in time. God damn. Carry on. Let's go kill some more of these guys. Whoa! Oh, he's coming at me, brave guy. I'm an idiot for running at a guy with a shotgun. Go! Yeah, I think I killed them all. I'm performing my public service. Let's get out of these woods. I'm getting You're trying to stop than it is. Birds don't always heal easy. Sure, but I think this will be fine. As long as it don't get infected. It's much better than I feared. Hear that, old man? This could have been worse. He's pretty weak. Yeah, I bet. Stay with us, you old bastard. Oh, don't let me fall, please. Over here. Almost back. Hang in there, old timer. I don't feel good. Does it look okay? Uh, Uncle. Uncle. Hey. We're here. Alright. Let's get you done. You see. I got you. I got you. Come Let's on. get him out there. Thank you, boys. Don't mention it. I thought I was dead. Uh, don't get all sentimental now, old man. And I'll really think you're dying. It's gonna be okay. A few days, you're gonna be just fine. You're a survivor. Easy, easy. Okay. 
He'll be fine. You think they'll be back? Maybe, but I doubt it. We must have killed most of them. Now, this is your land. Was it theirs once? I don't think so. I met a fellow said the Skinners rode down about two years ago. They're just angry men on a rampage, and we got in their way. Sort of like we used to be? <sighs> yeah, exactly like we used to be. Maybe we should take up torture. <laughs> uh, we got Uncle singing instead of torture. We're gonna be safe here, John. Hmm? You, your family, you all be safe. I hope so. I really do. If she ever comes back. Yeah, I'm sure she'll be here soon. I think I'm coming to that point in the game now. That she uh, returns to John. John. Yeah, no matter how, like, you know, how many times I hear other people say his name, Dutch says it with, like, the most memorable way. God damn it, John. John. He has that weird sort of, like, howl, almost, <laughs> to, that vo like, to his voice. Have that fine way with words. You doing all right, son? Sure, Pop. Can I go see the house? Sure. Just give him some time. He'll warm up. It's quite a place you got here. It's yours. Ours. I should see about that boy. Who's my new rival? Oh, that's Rufus. He's loyal, dumb, and angry, so he reminded us of you. That's your idea of a joke, miss? I guess. Come on! <laughs> that has to have been the quickest of missions. <laughs> the best of women. Just cutscene. That's all that was. You didn't. You didn't even need to make that a separate mission. It was just the family comes back at the end of saving uncle. Didn't have to have that little thing pop up saying the best of women or whatever. Uh, what's the other one? Oh, what's this? Jack Marston. Uh, trying again to could use some company. All right. Let's go see Jack then. How you getting on, son? Uh, fine, sir. What are you doing? Reading. And, uh, playing with the dog. You wanna go fishing or something? Not particularly. I don't really like fishing. Do you like eating, though, right? Because we got to find some food. Come on. Let's head this way to the stream. Okay, sir. Why you got to be like that? I'm sorry. It's okay. Do you wish I was more like you? Like me? No. But... Let's keep going. Can Rufus come fishing? Dogs scare the fish. But if you'd like him to, I guess. So you don't care if we don't catch fish? Yeah, I... I'm not very good at this. At fishing or walking? 
at talking with you. But fishing will be fun. Sure. Unless you want nothing but beans again. No. I'd like to fish. And it'll be pretty fun, I promise. Okay. It's fine being out with you, even though I can't say the right thing. And you, Pop. Yeah. This kind of like mirrors the first game in that you... Let's do more of this. After, at, at the end of the first sure. game, there is like a I mean, very small section yes. at the end where you control like Jack. Pretty as an adult, so... This, clearly having like an epilogue Grass, on the end light. of the game is clearly the Red Dead Redemption a hallmark, isn't it? Sure as Trade hell stamp. Is a lot of beauty. Yes. You'll see it better when you get older. It's tough at your age. Just... This is a real good fishing spot. Folk always say that, and hours later they've caught nothing. Ain't you just the leading authority on everything? Well, ain't it so? Well, maybe. In this case, it's true. I hear there's some real big fish in here. Big old steelheads. Hard to catch, but real good eating. Hard to catch. Get your excuses in early. That dog of yours know he's owned by a complaining know-it-all? Come on, son. I'm sorry. No, you ain't. It's all right. Come on, let's fish. Uncle Hosea, he was the fisherman, wasn't he? That's right. I remember Uncle Arthur taking me, though. Arthur taught you how to fish now, did he? Huh. Yeah. I suppose he did. That's nice. I got a bite. I got a bite. All right. Now stay calm and start reeling them in. Not too fast. You want to set the hook in tight. He's he's strong. Good. Now reel him in. Stay calm. Give him a tug. Now reel. I got him. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think? How do you feel? <laughs> I don't... I feel... I don't know. Thanks, Dad. I told you this was a good fishing spot. You did. Hey. My trip with Arthur... I remember now. I picked some flowers, and... A couple of men showed up. Dressed like they was from the city. No one like that's gonna show up here. Thank the Lord. Where's Rufus? I don't know. Relax. He's a dog. Where is he, though? I don't know. He's been eaten by a giant fish. I'll go find him. Rufus! Come on, boy! Rufus! No, oh, that's a pretty decent catch. Better go see what's happening with Rufus. Let me come help you look. Like him, Pop. Can you go to the other side of the Snake! Dad! Rufus! Rufus! No! It's a snake! I see. He bit him! Calm no. down, boy. And Jack, you calm down too. Come here. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do, Pa? Keep going! Go swallow it! Dad! Rufus, no! 
How much venom did they put in this thing? Oh, did the snake put in it? There He's gonna you go. die! He's gonna die! He'll be okay. We just gotta get him somewhere warm and calm. He's gonna die. Go get the fishing rods and the fish. I'm taking the dog home. Abigail! Can I get a hand? What, what's going on? Dog got bitten by a snake. Let's look after him. And the boy. Grab his rug. Is it gonna be okay? Jack, the dog is gonna be just fine. We never should have gone fishing. Sometimes, sometimes, you just don't know how things are gonna turn out. But, but the dog. The dog's gonna be fine. It's okay, son. All right, so uh, clearly uh, this place was actually up and running for quite a while before the agents came and took John away, which I did not realize. Because you sort of have to, to... I remember towards the end of Red Dead, you sort of have to start rebuilding the place and uh, bringing it back to... bringing the uh, cattle and stuff back into it. Hello, lady. Where are you? Let's go. So you happy? I think so. <laughs> and I did good? You did good. So... <laughs> am I forgiven? <laughs> Never. <sighs> you are a hard woman. <laughs> Ma! Pa! Come out here! Sadie! <laughs> You're alive! John, it's... Sadie Adler! <laughs> Well, how'd you know she was... We... I'm... Sorry, I you thought I... You well. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but tell me about you, darling. No, armed to the teeth like that. I'm a working woman, Abigail. I'm a bounty hunter, bodyguard. I protect the gold prospectors up in the hills. I'm thinking of starting my own transportation business. I was thinking... Maybe if John wanted to earn some money. My husband, he ain't looking for that kind of work. Took on a lot of debt when we bought this place. And you're working for her to pay it off? Yes, sometimes I was. But I thought we said no more of that. No, you said that. What else am I going to do? I'm a goddamn man. It's legal work, Abigail. And I never got killed. It's hunting down fools for the government. Easy. Even Jack could do it. Don't you put those stupid ideas in the boy's head. He's going to do something better than this. Like what? Writing silly stories? I'm sorry, Abigail. Really, I am. I just thought if you wanted to earn some money... How many times do I got to bury you, John Marston? Never. You ain't never burying me. It's legal work that I can handle. There's a... There's something else. Micah? Bounty hunting is one thing, but goddamn Micah? I heard he was up country, or some fellow who sounded just like him. Killed a family, bar a little girl who escaped. Leave Micah alone. Listen, I'm sorry, Abigail. I came by because I was riding by chasing a fella, and I thought John wanted to earn some extra money. <sighs> what is it? Abigail, we need the money. Some fella robbed his business. You know, an accountant or something. Came down from Rhodes, I believe. How much does it pay? It pays good. Well, the soft ones usually do. Okay, then. I guess. But Micah? No. All right. John Marston, let's go. Just you bring him back to me. You hear? Of course. Let's ride. Say your goodbyes, John. Get your horse and let's go. You ready? Follow me. We're going up into tall trees. Again. Isn't that where all those crazy people 
Boa. Nice of you to stop by and see the place. Finally. Abigail's back with the boy. You must be so pleased, John. And the ranch? You were right. It's really something. I think I'm gonna ask her to uh marry me. I got a ring. It was it was Arthur's. I found it in a bundle of things that I've kept. You're marrying Abigail. Or it, asking her at least. Oh my. I never took you for a romantic. No, me neither. But <laughs> it's something I've thought about. And I I think I know. I want it. Okay. I guess I thought you were married already. Long ago. No, not really. Not officially. Well, I'm real happy for you, Joan. Being married, it made me real happy. Yeah, it sounds like it made, made you really happy. Then again, of course it didn't, because she's been on this game-long crusade to kill all the O'Driscolls who killed her husband. So yeah, she must have been very happy. We're cutting off the main track up here. A man's in need of post. So, we're coming up on where he's been seen. This moron accountant, Marshall Thurwell, been trying to live like an outdoorsman. Camping out here. He's lucky the Skinner brothers ain't found him. Well, they might have. Are there any of those guys even left now? I'm sure I killed most of them. Must be it. Get down. Let's take a look around. Something's been here. This. This looks. Looks like a. Something came through here. <sighs> and fella left in quite a hurry. Here. Oh, he was from the south, whoever he is. Then maybe he's our man. If he ain't become some bear's lunch. Yeah, it looks like they went this way. Him or the bear? <laughs> Both of them. Or oh, just the bear after eating him, you never know. No guarantee he's alive. It's that way, I'd say. Great. Damn it! I lost the trail. Can you see which way he might have gone? Okay, I think I got him. Follow me. Uh, I've lost the trail. Oh, there it is. It keeps going through here. Yeah, this way. Nasty. Was this the accountant? Oh my god. Oh my god, that's disgusting. My god. Crap. Ugh, well, that ain't pretty. Oh boy. That our fella? Maybe. But looks more like a local farmer to me. What's the lift of one? Is it gone? You, Marshal Thurwell? That I am, ma'am. I'm here to arrest you on behalf of the state of Lemoyne. You're wanted for theft, fraud, and avoiding arrest. Is the monster still out there? No, I think he's gone. Come out! Come on. Don't shoot. <laughs> Keep walking. <laughs> 
Come on. I'm coming. Look out! Uh, it's coming back around. Oh my god. I think he's gone. Oh, fucking monster. Thurwell! Get out here! Before I come in there and kill you myself! I I I'm coming. Pathetic. Waiting to see if that animal ate us? No, ma'am. That weren't it. Yes, it were. Come here. Come here. Smack. <laughs> Thurwell, call yourself a man? Well, it's like Abigail says. That's one word for you. I can't believe we didn't kill that bastard. Gave him something to remember us by, at least. Yeah. You all right, John? Yeah. Ah. Just we always find a way to almost get killed, don't we? Mm-hmm. That's kind of the problem. Hmm. Maybe it wasn't right of me to bring you along on those really heavy things. Family man and all. Seeing all this, I don't know if I can do it again. I'm my own man, ain't I? I get to make those calls. I needed the money. You are your own man, sure. But I'm my own woman. And I get to say who I ride with. And I don't know if your ranch and your kid and your wife are things I want to be worrying about when I hear a gunshot. Yeah, fair enough. Those are fine new clothes, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I spend my cash on... Who's this up here? Is Wait, that... that's not my gun. Well, it is, but I don't want to use it. Are you Sadie Adler, man? The bounty hunter? Get off the road! Look, I got great respect for you professionally, but if that's Marshall Thorwell there... Uh, me and my partner would like to split the reward. For doing what? Get off the road! We was thinking you might need protection. I look like I need protection? Uh, me and my partner, we're dead set on splitting that reward. And if not, well, we said we was going to take all of it. <laughs> Drop it! Noobs. Them bastards was green. If we didn't get him, someone else would have. This is a cold business, ain't it? Yep. It does require a certain level of detachment. Let me see if I can get my thing. You ever think if it's right? No. I just see orders on the wall, and I try and fill them. And if there's other bastards after the same orders as I am, I get competitive. It's called industry. And if you ain't noticed, everyone is out there doing it. I guess they are. Oh, shit. It's called industry. Is it, though? Uh, is it really? You said earlier you knew something about Micah. You gonna tell me what you know? Are you sure you want to hear about him? Ain't all that back at your ranch enough? If I find him, I will handle it. Your bounties or transport work, that's your decision to bring me along or not. But, but Micah, that's something we, well, I, I gotta do. With or without you, Sadie. You know what I mean? Okay, okay. I know. Well, I'm hearing things. 
A lot of things. Still, mostly just whispers, but I think you might be pretty close. When you hear something real, you bring it to me. Okay. Why don't we just I'll go for the money you. that's here? But you think about if this is what you really want. Because everything you can get and everything you could lose. Because throughout the game we hear that there's money in Blackwater. Why don't we just go and get it? Is there any particular reason why we don't? Here, put him Do we down. not know where it is? Go on. Get home to your wife. I'll let you know if I hear anything about Micah. You need a hand taking him in? Him? <laughs> no, I'm fine. You sure? Yeah, I'll send your share to the bank when I get paid. Thank you. Not bad going. Not bad going at all. Uh, there's a, a really big bastard. Hello there. Uh, what's next? What have we got in the next part? Uh, a new future imagined. Alright, well, we got that coming up in the next part. For now, though, I'm going to call it quits. Hope you've all enjoyed this part. Hope you've all enjoyed the walkthrough. I am nearing the end of it now. Only about maybe two parts left, by my reckoning. Um... So yeah, I mean, overall I love this game. Probably not going to play it again for a long while after this walkthrough because it's taken me forever to record this, as most of you are probably aware. I think in the first one, I think I said Happy like Merry Christmas or something like that in the first part, in the first like, episode. It's like February now, um, recording this video. So yeah, it's been a while. Uh, if you guys could leave a like, comment and subscribe, that would be great. Check out the end screen for any suggestions on my channel of content you might like. And that's it. So for now, take care, look after yourself, carry on gaming, and I'll see you next time. Ta-da!